Collective. There is Net Nose Divine Healing here. So you have another message. I'm just getting this power stamp through here. Lit. Um, you guys, I have a channeled message and whoever's watching this video, hopefully they can get some clarity. Um, but this is really important for the collective to know right about now. And I'm gonna let you guys know a little bit. Um, well, I'll let you guys know what I have been, um, what I saw, you know. Um, I guess I am a, a seer as, um, let's see, Mystic Tori Tarot, as she um, explained, which makes sense. I uh, love her channel, she's very intuitive. And um, I'm going to get to what I have, um, or I'm going to get to what was revealed to me. And this is really important for the collective in general. And people who, who may, people who do have channels, who have active channels, and people who do not, excuse my nails, whatever, you know. So, um... The message I got is pretty much a person who is, I have to say it like this, somebody who is impersonating a spiritual um, light worker and someone is impersonating, someone who has a platform is impersonating a spiritual, um, a, a, who is impersonating a light worker. And pretty much what I saw was this person is getting snapshots of everyone um people who have a platform people who don't have a platform um this person is getting snapshots of everyone um and what they're dealing with and this person is operating in they're pretty much operating with the darkness you know there's no other way to put that they're operating with the darkness to um, to gain this light, to gain a fake light. Let me just be honest. Um, the light is not real that they are um, that they are portraying and that they are saying that they are um, representing. Um, and they're pretty much getting information, like they're finding ways to maybe tap into a lot of the collective and a lot of the other um you know a lot of the light workers that are of the light that are you know high rankings in their uh, spirituality in that um people that see things people that are getting downloaded messages they're pretty much um i'm not gonna say copying but they're impersonating um other people other people's messages and they're just pretty much um this person or th this could be a couple of people th this may not be just one um light worker this might be um a couple of light workers that are working with you know some type of darkness to to get um to get the attention as a as a light worker and this person is actually making it seem like they are being supportive of the collective that you know like this person is making it seem like they're trying to help the collective it's they're making it seem like they're trying to um help people with their channel and things like that and they're in and, and they're making it seem that way it's like that's what they're presenting to um to the collective they make they're making it seem like 
oh hey you know what I'll help you and and collective listen look out for that because some people are not who they say they are even though they have this platform and you know like you know and they have people commenting and all this on their page some people have different intentions I'm gonna be honest um and you know what I seen was it, it's like all that glitter is not gold at all uh let me get to the message this is my pink clipboard I like writing on this it's pink so it's awesome okay so let's see the messages I wrote down and you guys I was asleep for probably and I've been having trouble with sleep I you know I woke up and it was like five hours I counted I'm like wow I slept five hours that wasn't enough for me so you know I went on about my day and I said you know what I'm gonna try again uh, you know I was just asking I was asking um, I was asking God like God, what's going on with my sleep it seemed like and to be honest I took a sleeping pill I did I took a sleeping pill and I said you know what I'm gonna get some good sleep five hours tops that was it so um, so the next time I went to sleep I slept for about 10 hours maybe and I got this really big download and let's see I'm reading uh, let's see some people operating in the dark behind the scenes and showing up in the light fake light worker and this person is taking pictures I don't know if this is spiritually like in the 5d or what but it's almost like they're trying to cipher you know like some of the collective um, energy something like that it's like they're trying to it was really sick like when I seen like in my in my in my dream when I saw it it's like this person portrayed as if they made it seem like they wanted to help you and it was just like oh yeah 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 you know what let me go ahead and you know take your pictures and you know like let's say you know like it was like I had a date and it's like the prom let me put it like this the prom was the setting I got with this download everything was good you know the prom you know and I guess there's a time where you take pictures so I took pictures and there was like a line of people behind me it was like a line of you know couples or you know whoever they want to take pictures too and the person that was taking the pictures was actually um, not what was actually operating in okay let me try to get this message out there help me okay let's see let me just read the notes um, let's see prom date and it's crazy because it's like my prom date actually told me you know what I mean like out of his mouth that um he told me out of his mouth he said this is a fake light that's what he said he and I actually know the person in the dream so it was really crazy I was like what I'm like and it's like we never been to prom together um I've known him you know for a while I'm not gonna say his name of course but you know from the time I've known him it's been a while so you can say that we are acquainted individuals um and let's see and we took prom pictures it's like we had a good time at the prom it was all good but where is um, yeah this person is pretending to be supportive of other light workers but actually not and this could honestly be a plan some some type of I don't know what dark people do some type of scheme to get I mean like to maybe suppress you know real spiritualists or something it's so weird um let's see 
Okay, here it is. This is what I wrote. Um, and, um, let's see. So, when we were taking the pictures outside, you know, like for prom, I guess we was going outside taking the pictures, and it appeared to be a bright sunny day, and it's, uh, let me explain. <laughs> Spirit help me. So, okay, so it's like, all of the light that was outside, well, that appeared to be light, um, it had changed. It changed, and I guess everyone was done taking the pictures. Excuse me, I'm thirsty. Okay, it's 10 minutes. Okay, whatever, I'm gonna keep going. So it's like the light, it was crazy. I was like, what? So I was looking into, you know, I guess all the pictures were, uh, had been taken. Everyone got their uh, prom photo. And when it was, I guess when the photos, I guess when it was time to stop the, um, you know, the picture taking, it was like, a mechan it was like mechanical dark wings it was like mechanical yeah it was like mechanical dark wings came up from the light and like flew away and then and when and when and when that fake light left it was just darkness it was just it was just darkness it was like the sky was just dark and my prom date, he said, that light is fake. He said, that's not a real light. I was like, you know, I was kind of like, not, not a real light. And when I seen it, when I seen the light vanish, almost like fly away, you know, like that's around the time I just woke up. Um, so yeah. Yeah. Someone is presenting fake light to the collective and they are actually operating in the darkness to portray a light I don't know if it's for financial gain or if it's for I don't know I just don't know like um could be could be not I can't say what people's motives are but I know I want to do a reading for you guys and that's what I'm gonna get to about this fake about this fake light worker posing as a you know a spiritualist um but they actually are not so i'm thinking in my head i guess this person is a karmic that i mean that's the only thing i can think of that would make sense so you guys i'm going to go ahead and uh get some messages on this um I have to move some of my covers. They're kind of in the way from my awesome, not so awesome shuffling. Okay. Spirit. Holy Spirit. Help me with giving the collective. And you know, I still don't know if I want to uh, post this reading. Because I just don't know, like it, it, it's getting really, it's it's getting really ridiculous. Um, uh, one of my subscribers, um, Mystic Tori, who I'm subscribed to, Mystic Tori has she was on point with the message that I seen from her. The message is called. Do not allow your soul to be exposed and compromised. You guys should check that out for further confirmation. But there's some, there's some dirty, I guess, there's some dark workings going on in the collective right about now. Um, that's the only way I can explain it. But somebody is portraying to be, um, 
of the light and for whatever reason I don't know if they're trying to look at this the devil you know the devil page of cups they might be trying to stop people from getting started with um, honestly getting started with helping the collective and I know I did um, some of the readers that had um, promoted oh hey I'll help you with your channel I'll be a supporter and I feel like it's only to know who is trying to um, and look I pulled the devil again look at that the devil again knight of wands yeah this, this person is passionate um but obviously not not connected how they need to be of the light but they are infiltrating the collective i don't want to make it seem like you know what i'm gonna just make it I'm gonna just say what the hell I feel like, honestly. Look, the devil again. Why does he keep pulling the devil? The devil just the devil keeps coming out. Um, but yeah, um, I had asked for support. I'm not gonna name any names. I've written messages. Um, I've written messages to two two um two people um who i'm i'm subscribed to let me make sure my volume's up hold on oh no it was not up okay it's up now and i could be too loud but oh well um and i still don't know if i'm gonna post this one because i might just take a break with this and or I might just do my readings and don't post them because I feel like I've put myself out there to certain readers. I'm not naming any names, but they 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 are literally, um, you know, it was just like nothing. It's like there was no response to anything. And it and it made and it made me think, and and as I slept on it, and I saw what I saw, I knew that this was um, that this is what was going on with the collective. People are not people are not of the light how they say they are. So we have to be careful with the information we let them have. Um, and I think Mystic Tori says something about some people are just not equipped to even give you readings, to be honest. So we have to really be more discerning. And I might just, I might just take a break, honestly, because I'm just getting started, but I still get downloads. I still get messages. Um, you know I've gotten messages all my life I've gotten you know I, I, I have visions I do ever since I was a little girl um, you know I found myself in different places and you know different people different um, you know whatever but Holy Spirit Holy Angels I'm gonna get to this reading because it is 19 minutes if I do post it, I do not want it to be too long. Okay, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, give me some confirmation. Well, give me some messages about who is, about what's going on with, um, about what's going on with, with, uh, with some of these fake light workers. Um, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, give me some messages um, that the collective need to know about what's going on with some of these fake light workers. Um, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Okay, all this went 
All this came out. Oh gosh, should I take them? Let's see, templates, two of pentacles, five of swords, seven of pentacles, six of cups. Let me, let me shuffle one more time. Give me not so many. Holy <laughs> Spirit, Holy Angels, any messages that I need to know, that a collective needs to know about this energy here. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, give me some messages that the collective needs to know about these people. Who are okay? These rolled out. Okay. Temperance and Two of Pentacles. We have Temperance. Now, Mystic Tori, she just, I, I just seen her reading before I started mine. But she says something in particular about this Temperance card. And this is someone who can also be a shapeshifter here. So. Thank you, Mystic Tori, if you see this reading. Thank you. Um, so someone is, yep, look at that. Balance, patience, blending. Look at that, blending right here. Oh, and thank you, Mystic, Mystic Beauty, for your easy read tarot cards and for helping me to read tarot. Shout out to her. Yeah, this person is blending in two of pentacles so this could be someone who is two of pentacles this person could be juggling their finances so it could be someone who's in it for financial reasons and now don't get me wrong I know I have um, options for donations down below but that's just but that's just it you know i'm not i'm not going out of my way to try to make anyone um you know donate it's just whatever is in your heart if you want to if you don't you know it's kind of like you do you do you do you don't you don't um you know but all of it is appreciated all of it is appreciated um if you do yeah, this person is juggling their finances and they could be growing through some financial strains here. So someone's blending in, uh, you know, blending in with, with the collective, as you can see. All right, Holy Spirit, give me some more messages on who this person is. And what's going on? Anything we need to know, Holy Spirit? I think I'm going to pull some of my cards after this. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, can you um, give us some messages for the collective and what they need to know? I think I should, probably should have took that one. That's okay. That's too many. It rolled out. Angels, give me some messages for the collective and what they need to know. These two in my hand. Take them. Okay, so Five of Pentacles and Queen of Wands. Five of Pentacles, this person or these people, they are focused way too much on the material. And Queen of Pentacles, they may see some of the collective as Queen of, um, as Queen of Pentacles. And they know that you are doing well 
and they are um, <clears throat> taking advantage. That's just the only thing I can say. They are taking advantage of some of the collective that is well off. Um, or, or they want the collective to miss um, opportunities. They want the collective the collective to miss um, financial opportunities. Um, they're focused way too much on the materials here. So when you're focused on the money and you're not giving messages out of your heart, out of your out of your heart space, this one turns to the side. King of Swords. Okay. So this is someone who is king of swords. This person knows what they're doing. This person is very, um, although they may or may not be, I don't think this person is as tapped in, but they are using their logic. They're using their logic on how to um, on how to gain money. Um, this person is, is watching um, a lot of people. Yeah. Let me look at this card. Yeah, expert in his field. Yeah, this person knows how to, um, you know, say what they need to say. Um, you know, to really mislead the collective, I'm gonna be honest. You can't be led in the right direction when the person is honestly looking for money. It's, it's, it's all for gain, you know? Holy Spirit, any more messages for the collective? Two of Wands. Two of Wands right here. Okay. This person knows, or these people know what direction they want to go. And they're planning to have success with with the um with the foolery honestly Holy Spirit any more messages any more messages okay Wheel of Fortune. All right. Wheel of Fortune. So I feel like this is really for you, Collective. Um, I feel like the Wheel of Fortune, I feel like the Wheel is going to turn in your favor regardless of what this um of what these people um are trying to stop or trying to infiltrate here because it's like you know first of all what's for you is going to be for you and can't anybody take that away period um let's see any more messages Any more messages? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. This one and two turn over. Five of Wands. 
Okay, so there is there's a lot of competition going on. This person or these people are really in competition and are they trying to put you in competition? And honestly, it's like, you know, when it comes to a community of light workers and just people that are trying to help each other out, this should not be anywhere in it. What is this competition? What, what is this? You know. It is ridiculous. Look, competition for resources, personality clash, you know, thank you, Misfit, for these cards for helping me. And it's like, what in the world? You're moving away from this. Honestly, like, can't nobody take anything that is not theirs and they're going to deal with the karma if they try to. Um, and I'm starting to see a lot of some of the people, I would just say people, I'm not going to exclude any, anything, but some of the people and where their messages are coming from, because I can see, you know, okay, this one popped up, Page of Cups, yes, this person, This person is trying to take a skill, trying to perform a skill that is like a gift for you. It's like, yeah, yeah, this person, okay, here it is. This person is trying to cause conflict Trying to cause conflict for your new beginning, honestly. You know, and the main thing I saw in my, uh, you know, in my channeled uh, message was this person or these people acting like they want to help the collective. They'll say, "Oh well, yeah, I'll go ahead and um, you know, you know, I, you know, I'll support anyone, you know." But the reality is they want to support themselves and actually and them taking a picture and I think that that was a big part because when they took a picture it's like they was able to see what they wanted to see it's like what they needed to see to get from it and once the picture taking was over that light disappeared literally and then it was darkness so it's like, what are you doing? You know, it makes you think, what the heck are you doing? It's like, what are you taking these pictures? It's like you're taking people's, uh, trying to take their blueprint or I don't know what. That dream was just, whew. The person that was in the dream, I couldn't believe it. I was like, oh my gosh. But we were just having a good time, you know? The world turned over again. Should I take it? I'm gonna take these, okay. Yeah. Okay, so we have the world card right here. We have four pinnacles. The tower. Concentrate, concentrate. Should I back it up? Concentrate. Okay, there we go. And the fool. Okay, there we go. Alright, so it looks like 
you're gonna have success um or this person hold on hold on one minute one minute where pinnacles tower is full financial control so this person who is trying to distract you or trying to mess up your new beginning or whatever you're starting um This person is going to have some financial issues, probably for for taking from the collective, you know, collecting from the um, collecting from the collective, collecting from the collective, right? Um, tongue twister, and then they're gonna, yeah, they're gonna um, experience the tower moment. from this because you are not supposed to try to cipher energy or to flip and um, get a picture of what everyone else is doing and then take that to make money pretty much but you are going to have a new beginning you're going to have a new beginning right here you're gonna take a you're gonna take a leap of faith, uh, regardless. But this person is not, um, you know, this this person is not going to uh, be able to get away with this. I mean, you're really not getting away with anything, uh, especially during, uh, you know, year of was it year or decade of Aquarius um, everything's gonna come to light um, justice will be uh, in favor let's see at 37 minutes let's see how is it how the angels is there any other messages I'm trying to see if I can read any now the fool now this might be an Aries could be an Aries or Earth sign, maybe. I'm trying to. Which one? Oh, you guys, I'm still getting familiar with reading the signs from the tarot. Holy Spirit, is there any more messages? Just some popped up. The lovers. Oh, this could be a Gemini. Could be a Gemini who's doing this. Who is acting as if they're helping, but they're really helping themselves. Um, this one wanted to come out. Hierophant could be a Taurus. This could be a Taurus that's acting like they're helping, but they're helping themselves. Lord, these are just coming on out. Holy Spirit, any more messages? Anything else? I see that Queen of Wands. This could be in Aries or a fire sign. Any more messages? For the collective? These two came up. Knight of Wands, Six of Swords. Knight of Wands. Did I already get... I think I've already pulled this one. So this person could have gotten sick. Wands. This person is charming. This person is very charming. And they could have been 
They could have just um, moved for somewhere, from somewhere. Yeah, this place seems very um, enticing, I would say. They could have just been... They, they could have been sick and they're, um, you know, trying to restore their health. And it could honestly be from this betrayal here. Like, I see this as a betrayal. I see it as treason. I see this as someone who is, what's the name? You know, it's like when you have an inside man that's like actually like betraying someone who's actually like an op. I'm going to say it like that. This person is, this person is like an op, but they are hiding themselves as uh, a light worker. And I am at 41 minutes here. I don't think I really have enough time to do use my messages. I'm going to do that for the next reading. But I'm going to leave it right here. And I'm going to get some more clarifying messages with my deck. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And if you want to donate, down below I have my cash app. And I have the link to my GoFundMe account. And I will see you guys later. Bye.